Hello everyone, this is Stone and I am here playing a game called Tap Heroes. Yes, it's a clicker game, but it's a little bit more in, uh, in depth, sh I should say, than most other clicker games. So the thing that makes this clicker game special compared to the others is how you can actually heal yourself and attack, you know, heal yourself, make sure you don't die and stuff. Because your health is up here, their health is down here. You can also upgrade your heroes and everything. You can upgrade your powers and your heroes. And it's surprisingly in-depth, and I'm kind of surprised at how in-depth it is. I'll just go ahead and continue to the next area. And, you know, it's basically, it is, well, it, it is just a clicker game. But, it's actually a decent clicker game, that's the funny thing. If I've learned anything from playing games, it's to upgrade your speed, and your damage, and then your crit. Because crit will just wreck everything. Look at that. Look at how much damage I did to that thing. But yeah, the power I can upgrade... Um, <clears throat> I can upgrade it to maximum beforehand. So if you look, you know, level 5 attack, and also upgrade the damage in here. And um, this game is actually surprisingly fun and not stupid. I, mean, I know that most clicker games are really, really, really stupid. But this surprisingly is not. And if you're wondering what these are, these are for your clicky clicks. So, you know, more heals, more damage, that kind of stuff. So if I set it to heal... See, now it does five, up to five now. In fact, it even says in the top right corner, I didn't even notice that. So if we just wait to get up to 28, and we will just take a look at... Now it does three to six. Now it is undefeatable. Well, it's actually very defeatable, but you know, you get the point. So let's go to the next area. And as you see, it's just, you know, one of those games that you can just waste time on, and it's fun. I mean, it's worth it. I don't remember if it actually costs anything. I really don't remember. Um, it probably does, but I don't remember, so I can't say for sure. So this is pretty much all the game is. Hang on, I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Ow. <clears throat> okay. So that's awesome, you know? It's just a really, really, really good time waster. So let's go into the next area. And this is the boss area. I'm basically the healer and the uh, DPS and the tank and everything at once. It's kind of like playing an MMO by yourself and doing it good. I will buy the mage. Yeah. How much money do I get from that? Quite a bit. Heroes. Mage. Oh, okay, so that helps upgrade. Okay, power. Yeah, this is actually pretty in-depth, like, surprisingly. I wasn't expecting it to be quite this in-depth, to be completely honest. Uh, the second I saw this in my inventory, or well, not inventory, but you know, on my games list, I immediately thought, oh, great. I've got another clicker game, another time waster. Which it is a clicker game and a time waster. It's surprisingly in-depth, though. Because like I said, I was not expecting this level of, like, in-depthness from this game. I was expecting something that would just be stupid and retarded and not worth it. What I did get is something that's surprisingly fun. And it actually is a lot of fun. You level up. You level up. I will level up your attack. Ooh, I got a thing. 
If I get five of those, I can get the thingy. Achievement unlocked. Fighter. Let's see what achievements I've got. Fighter. Defeat 100 enemies. Oh, uh, okay, gotcha. Um, let's go into Warrior, and um, let's go his speed. And let's wait to upgrade his speed again, because I really need to upgrade that speed. Yeah. I'll wait to upgrade his speed again. I like my DPS, you know? I mean, doing damage itself is fun, but I also like, you know, damaging him and everything. You know, doing legitimate damage. So yeah, there isn't a whole lot to this game. Uh, main reason why I'm recording this is because I didn't record a video yesterday, and I actually don't have time to record a full-time video today. So you guys will have to stare at a clicker game while I click and talk. I am professional, I swear. I am the utmost of professionalism. I am professional, just like Nerd Cubed. That doesn't say something, I don't know what does. Lucky charm! Let's upgrade your speed and your speed. Yes. I was gonna say words and I failed horribly. But yeah, that's uh, pretty much what this game is for the most part. And I literally, I, I started playing it the second I started recording. I was going to play it earlier, but I had the SLI thing over here because I accidentally turned on the, the, the uh, monitor for the SLI, or like the SLI monitor screen thing. So it was over on this side of the screen. So let's do Will. Mage's chance of double heal. Double chance percent is seven. Very nicely done. Very nicely done, indeed. Let's up his health a little bit. Yeah, this is a very, very fun time waster. I'm having a bit too much fun with this, I think. Potions. Oh, but healing potions are useless. If I can just click on my own person and heal him. Like, why would I want to do that? I mean, I guess maybe it makes sense. I don't know. I need to level up my attack on my clicker. Yeah. So, you might want to upgrade your powers first, maybe upgrade the health of your person, and then work on your, uh, your, um, everything else, basically. Yeah, because you definitely want to heal on, or health on your warrior, and then work on getting the attack and the heal and crit and stuff on your powers. Achievement unlocked, loaded. What are that? Is that it? Loaded. Collect 1,000 gold. Thank you. What's that? Level up 50 times. Already? Find five chests. Anything more? Yes. Defeat Trusky. Okay, and those are just the boss achievements. Screw it, I'm just gonna click here. Probably shouldn't be going after him. No, I'm just gonna walk away. Hey. That was probably a horrible mistake. Hi, dude. I'm gonna punch you in the face. I'm gonna level up your crit chance. There we go. That's seven percent to crit. All those are pretty leveled up. Maybe I could level up his power. Hmm. Leveling up his power would make more sense so that he could heal more. Major healing power. Yeah, twelve to something or other. There we go, 14 to 28. And they go back to the warrior. Yeah. Um, let's work on his attack. Yes, no, let's work on his attack. His attack damage should hopefully be the utmost strength. And next, let's work on the healing of my mouse. Maybe the speed of the mage. Well, the mage is already pretty high speed as is. 
Ah, I need my freaking click bind. Ah. I don't have my click bind right now. Because I closed Razor Synapse because stupid things. There we go, speed. Hopefully he should heal better. I think it's safe to say that we could go over and attack him now. Not really. Okay, so that's pretty much what this is. You basically just have to micromanage it. I wasn't sure how it would actually be. You know, legitimately hoping to take out the Gogapic. Is he just, like, doing more damage the further we go? Come on, he's on his last bar of health. Let's go. Got him. The rogue. Yeah, let's get the rogue. Oh, okay, so he poisons him. Doesn't do direct damage, but he, like, slows him and poisons him. Okay. Hmm, that's interesting. Very interesting indeed. Okay. Yeah, stun power. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Potency? Oh, frequency. Okay. Frequency of the damage. Health and crit. So yeah, that's pretty much how this game goes. I don't think there's a whole lot more to it. If there is, I sure don't know about it. Um, let's upgrade his speed, like, many times. And then poison. Yeah, poison damage. Oh, hello. Thank you for the gem. I think it's probably time to upgrade my warrior some more, with some more damage. So this person that I kill, I'm going to use what I get from him to upgrade damage. Okay, that should be useful. There we go. Next level. Hmm, this is very interesting. I wonder what the max level is, because I'm only on level 12 right now. Because uh, I hope it's not too bad. Because this is not a game that I'm gonna be, that I'm eh, that I'm gonna be playing for a lot. And this is just a simple maybe like click and then time waste for a few minutes and then done. For what it looks like, this game might take a while to actually you know do stuff in. Stun, yes, definitely upgrade the stun. Let's work on getting the will up for him. Uh, yeah. I'm close to being able to level up his will. There we go. Got him. Let's go to the rogue, because he still has the potency really, really down. Ah, uh, now it's up. War. So yeah, um, if you guys want to just go play this game, or look, you know, go buy this game, or whatever, it's... I don't remember... I have no idea how much it costs. Yeah, how much it costs, because I bought it off of a bundle. So, it could be the most expensive game in the entire world. I don't know. I just know that I got it off the bundle. But, yeah, there's not a whole lot to it. Like I said, I'm recording this because I forgot to record a video yesterday. So, yeah. So, I hope you all enjoyed. Like and favorite if you enjoyed. Subscribe to someone today. And I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.